The cabinet gives a green signal to the new education policy after 34 years. Let's dive into the key highlights. Starting with the early years, children will now begin their journey with nursery at four years, junior KG at five and so on. Language matters. Up to fifth grade, students will be taught in their mother tongue, local language and national language. English and others, yep, they're subjects now. Say goodbye to 10th board exams. Now only the 12th board exam is mandatory, bringing a breath of fresh air for students. Enter the semester system. Exams from 9th to 12th grade follow the 5 plus 3 plus 3 plus 4 formula, providing a more continuous and comprehensive assessment. College life just got more flexible. A three or four year degree awaits with a four year degree offering the chance to complete MA in just one year. Goodbye, MPhil. MA students can now directly pursue PhD, streamlining the path to higher education. Flexibility is key. Students can take breaks to explore other courses during their educational journey, but that's not all. Higher education is getting a makeover too. Uniform rules for all, autonomy for institutions, and technology integration with e-courses in regional languages and virtual labs. Here, examinations are designed to assess a student's grasp of language and their ability to understand and interpret information. Introducing the National Educational Scientific Forum, NETF, for fostering educational and scientific excellence. Exciting times ahead. The new education policy aims for inclusivity, flexibility and excellence. Subscribe for more updates as we navigate this transformative journey together. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell for the latest educational updates. Until next time, happy learning.